Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough 9-7, the Royal Treasure Room. I think as you get the name, I mean, as you get through this level, you'll notice that this is less about being a level as it is more of a way to collect stuff and whatnot. I mean, yeah, it is a level per se, but what I mean is that it's not something that's difficult. It, it's just something for you to look around and find stuff in and yeah. Starly, my lady, thank you so much for defeating those villains. To show our thanks, all of us guards want to share a legend with you. Just ask us. Okay, I'll ask you now. Oh, 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 oh Starly, do, do you know that uh, song? It's my favorite. It's all about Starfy. Listen to the song. Yep, title screen music. I'll sing it for you. I can't carry a tune, but I make up for it with extra effort. Oh, 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 oh. I'm good, I'm good. Maybe later. Oh, really? Well, alright. I guess I'll just go back to my singing practice. La, 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 la. Uh, anything else? Do, 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 do. Mm, nope, 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 guess not. Okay. <laughs> Moving on, there's actually more. I mean, there's another guard to see later on, if I'm not mistaken, uh, with an actual story, so yeah. Uh, well, these, there's these two guards. Starly, my lady, how fair is the rest of Puff Top Palace? Better now that I'm here. Wait a sec, where is here? I've never been inside this room. This is where we keep the treasures of the palace, and our giant pearls, too. If you're tired and need them to help you on your travels, feel free to take what you need. And yeah, this is what this place basically is. It was made to be like the pearl gathering place. But I still think that the place, that single room in Mashtooth's place, when you could keep chaining the enemies, was the best place to get pearls in. Anyway, what do you guys else have to say? We shall never leave our posts. We will protect the palace at all costs. Mm, pearls, heart. So many pearls, hearts. But anyway, the reason why I think the one at Mashtooth is uh, easier to collect pearls in is because you can do it all in a single room, as opposed to having to go through this level to collect stuff. Yeah. Uh, another guard. Thank you so much for defeating those villains and saving the palace. To show our thanks, each of the guards have a legend to tell you. Just ask us. Please tell, talk to them when you want to hear one. Oh, right now, now, now. Oh, Starly, have you ever met Mo's family? They're very smart. They've come up with quizzes all day. Maybe we can meet them soon. But first, I have, a pl <clears throat> I have to plan a surprise for your birthday. Well, you just ruined the surprise because you mentioned it. We've got this <clears throat> cake. <clears throat> it wraps a Starly. Why are you covering my mouth? If you tell me about it, then it won't be a surprise for my birthday, now will it? A good point. Um, sorry? <sighs> I, s I swear some of the characters are just derp derp derp. <laughs> anyway, pearls! Lots of pearls! This is what I meant about it being a pearl paradise. Well, maybe it would be faster to go through this, this stage than it would be to... Um... To... Uh, go back and forth between that room in uh, uh, Planet Banera, and yeah, I'm failing this hawk here. <laughs> but I don't know. I, I mean, it, it, hmm, well, maybe. I don't know. This, this, this is a pretty good pearl gathering spot, although it's pretty hard to get these higher ones without good timing. Reminds me of that mini game in Kirby games that I could never get the number one spot. <laughs> yeah, that sort of thing. I don't know, something about me and bouncy games just doesn't sit well, I guess. <laughs> See what I mean? Okay, alright, I think I cleared it out here. <laughs> um, there are more stuff, to, I mean, there is more stuff to see. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, gotta go back through this door and then through this door now. But you probably expect that. And this immediately goes into a water segment. I don't know how this door prevents the water from flooding into the other area, but that is how it works. <laughs> anyway, there's a bunch more pearls you couldn't possibly miss no matter what side you float down this tube. Yep, see, you can go bottom, you can go top, you're still gonna touch the pearls no matter how you go through them. So it's pretty efficient to get pearls here, I suppose. 
maybe this level is the best place to get pearls because, you know, in terms of time to get through said level and whatnot. And look at that, we're at the end! We're at the end! Yeah, it's a short stage. Starly, thank you so much for defeating them. To show you my thanks, I will share a secret legend with you. Let me know when you get a sec. And this is the final legend. You're ready to hear my story, aren't you? Legend of Puff Top, number five. Hee <laughs> hee, yeah, this one's really good. I promise, don't tell anyone, okay? The story of the careless and somewhat clumsy prince is not quite over. This all happened about 10 years ago. A sleepy little fel <clears throat> fellow who looked like a lot, who looks a lot like Prince Starfy and his clammy friend fell from Tough Top into the ocean and started an adventure. Hmm. Clammy friend? Sure sounds like my brother in that shellhead pal of his. Wait, did this story really happen in Puff Top? Oh yes, many, many years before you were even born, Lady Starly. You can even ask any of the soldiers. They'll tell you about all about the sister who kept close watch over her very careless brother. What? Are you telling me, trying to tell me something? I get it, alright? Always protect my brother. Yeah, that's the story. <laughs> oh, I just realized. Apparently, Conk is in this stage as well, so I kind of forgot to look around a little better. Hmm. I'm going back in. <laughs> going! Uh, going around to see if there's anything suspicious, like perhaps a wall, perhaps an enemy blocking a hole, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, it's something that I heard Conk is in here, and yeah. It's gotta be pretty well hidden if I didn't see a pathway to him, unless it's, like, somewhere... No, I didn't think so. Hmm. Anyway, it's a short stage without talking to those guys, so... I probably don't need the cut, but I'm... Yeah, I'm... I wrote down that I heard Conk was in... Ah, no, 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 start, start, stop! I can't skip this, can I? Okay, I can skip it, okay. <laughs> but yeah, I, I heard that Conk is in this stage as well... Somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, oh, oh! Or is that just the way back from up top that I missed? Hmm. Hmm. Could be. Might be. Most likely. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah. This just takes you back through here, and yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I. Maybe the person that wrote down Conk is in this stage was mistaken? I don't know? Maybe I'm the one that's just not searching hard enough? But yeah, I don't remember Conk being in this stage, now that I think about it. Hmm... Yeah, none of these would really conceal any specific thingamabobs, because they're at the edge of the screen. And, hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, oh, maybe something down here? No? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'll leave that for later and see if I can find him in that stage, but I don't think he is. <laughs> anyway, now you might be wondering. Well, I heard there's a stage 10 from that one treasure chest diary thing, so where's stage 10? Well, you have quite the conundrum here. You have to figure out how to unlock stage 10 on your own. Well, go to the case, and remember the one thing that we haven't done yet? Or I should say, we haven't really went through yet? Big boss down. That is how you unlock stage 10, if you go through it. But you can't just go through it. You have to go through it in under 9 minutes. Not exactly 9 minutes, under 9 minutes. And you can choose whether to use Starfy or Starly. Um, if you use Starly, you'll actually unlock a secret cutscene once you get all the way down to Mega Mashtooth and beat him with Starly. But uh, for now, let's do Starfy because he is much, much faster. Ready? 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 Let's go! Timer! Alright, just hit him every time you see the tentacle. No time for dilly-dallying, no time for messing around. Take out Big Squiddy ASAP. 
Uh, it seems like it would be pretty easy to, to defeat the bosses in under 9 minutes when you see the timer stopped after this boss here. But a bunch of the bosses, um, yeah, they are longer than others. And notice that the timer keeps going on that stage, I mean, that on that place that you could, um, ah, shoot. That you could, <sighs> shoot, get Pearl Sprite, I mean, get Pearls from the Pearl Sprite. Well, that's because the, um, oh, that's right, I gotta hit underneath him. For, oh, poopers, I'm really screwing up here. Maybe I should just restart this in the beginning. Um, the thing about that is it, it makes you have a choice um, whether you want to burn time or if you would like to, um, like, if you want to heal before uh, boss fights. And, man, I am really failing this. I'm gonna restart for this in the beginning. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, here we go. Less talking. More playing. Get ready, go! Maybe I should have practiced the bosses a little more before I uh, went here. And yeah, I'm, I'm even taking hits on Big Squiddy. Come on now, PK Gan. This is first boss easiness. Yeah. Let's just attack when I can, destroy the rocks when I have to to save myself a hit. And there we go. I think that was, a, yeah, that was a bit slower. Dang it! <laughs> But then again, I couldn't do worse at the hot spring snap, could I? Go, 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 go! Oh shoot, I gotta jump over! That's right, I can't go through it. I am sucking all over the place. There we go. Just hit him ASAP. Oh, 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 there we go. Nope, 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 need to go back under him. The most optimal way is to get him to, like, stop underneath one of those things, you know, the geysers. And yeah. There we go, because you can shoot, shoot, okay, 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 oh shoot, no, 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 oh wait, okay, second, I mean, second phase, yeah, go, 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 hurry, 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 <laughs> it's relatively easy to get under nine minutes, I just wanted to make the first two runs sort of efficient, if at all possible, and, eh. nope, 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 there we go, all right, Hot Spring Snapper, get back on screen. Need to speed run you. Ah, dang it. No. Mm. Dear. Mm. This is not going very efficiently. Yeah, I probably should have practiced the bosses more. <laughs> oh, he's dumb. All right, let's see how things go. Next up, King Ping. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> that Pearl Sprite could be my worst enemy. And King Ping here can be a run killer if he doesn't stop. I should say if I don't get the timing. Ow, dang it. Underneath the icicles and whatnot. Yeah. King Ping is probably one of the worst bosses that I perform at. Look at that, the timer is even going in the cutscene. Curses, cutscene. Curses, cutscene. Fall, fall, fall. There you go, there we go. Wait for it to respawn. Now hit him in the noggin. Well, that works. I, I was gonna do. I was gonna hit him in the noggin, but that's apparently a one-hit kill. That never worked for me before. Well, that's. Oh shoot! Didn't mean to do that. Well, might as well get some health as long as I did that. <laughs> but yeah, that never worked for me before, and I tried to hit him with an icicle when his noggin was exposed like that. But maybe I just did it wrong or something. Anyway, come over here, peeps. Come on. There we go. Make it over here. Lead him to the edges get him to be as efficient as possible. Actually, defeat him as efficiently as possible. Just, why are you going down there? Yeah, he doesn't always follow you, but he usually does. I guess it's because he's switching forms. Okay, now... Uh, as long as you go to the edges, I don't really mind where you go all that much, in all honesty. I... Go. 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 Oh, I almost got knocked out myself. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, I went through him. No, 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 no. This is failing. This is failing bad. <laughs> I'm rushing too much. I admit that, but I have to get under eight minutes. There we go. I'm not going to bother uh, recovering health for Ronk. Let's just be honest here. Oh, I still hit the Pearl Sprite. <sighs> Ronk, go, 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 go. And this is why I'm not going to re uh, recover for Ronk, because he's just... Another one of these, it's one of these things where you just gotta hit him in rhythm like so. As long as you aren't in his waves of doom there. Not really all that big of a deal. 
obviously this is one of those sorts of things where they make you do a choice of whether you want to go and do it the easy route by taking the water switches or hitting the water switches down below or um, hitting them normally up there like that. But obviously if you want to save time you gotta hit them up top uh, and put yourself in harm's way more often. But uh, yeah, it's not that difficult to beat Ronk that way anyway. Alright, Snips. Mm. Nope, nope, dang it. Snips. Snips can be another run killer. <laughs> Because she has pool balls, you gotta knock into her. Yeah, I know they're bombs, but it's it's like playing pool. No, 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 no. Oh wait, it's gonna go around and hit her. Yeah! <laughs> Just think of the angles, think of the bounce angles. Don't mess up any good angles that are working in your favor. Like that one's gonna go, oh, no, it's not gonna quite hit her. Oh, yeah, there we go. Alright, 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 alright. Mm. Oh, shoot. Next up after this will be the terrible trio, so I should probably uh, recover some health. Oh, that worked. <laughs> Pearl Sprite, save me. Yeah. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give okay, go, 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 go. No time for more pearls. Go. Peeps first, because he is. Ah, shoot. By far the most, I mean, the thing that gets in the most way. No, stop it. No, I'm locked. That's why he gets in the way the most of the time. <laughs> he he kind of like pushes you into stuff and then he, yeah, he stuns you enough so, to the point that you can't. Uh, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, shoot. He was inside his shield. There we go. He's down. Let's go take care of Ronk. Mm. Yeah. Go. Mm. Yeah. No, bombs, dang it. Yeah, there we go, he's down. Oh, bombs, yeah. <laughs> Where'd she go? Where did she go? Oh, she's over there. Where is she up there? Mm. Okay. Come sniffs. Go somewhere where I can work with you here. Mm. Yeah, there we go. One more, one more. Will it go without a shield? There we go, okay. Does she have a shield in that? I'm pretty sure she does, if she can. Anyway, Mash Tooth is next. And Mega Mash Tooth is after that. Alright, similar strategy to Ronk here. Jump over. Oh, shoot! Didn't need to do that. Well, you can actually do uh, more damage if you... Shoot, I'm failing now. If you do that, yeah. I forgot about that. How could I for... Oh, shoot. How could I have forgotten about that? Anyway, I think I want to go to this side. Uh, Mash Tooth. Okay. Hey. Oh, yeah, that's very effective. I must keep that in mind for future runs against bosses. And you know, sucking me in, huh? 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 Well, this is gonna stall for time, unfortunately. <laughs> that is probably your best defense against me since I gotta get under. Ow! Under nine minutes. Uh, I just wanna hit you as soon as you are done doing that. There we go. Had to be in good position to do that. Done! Now for Mega Mash Tooth. Uh, do you recover immediately? Doesn't look like it. Ah, poopers. Go, 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 go! Three minutes to defeat it! Well, actually, less than three minutes. Go! Mega Mash Tooth! Ah! <laughs> we can do this! We can do this! Go, 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 Slowing down the emulator like before a little bit. Mm. Yeah! Yeah! Oh shoot, don't do that, don't be careless. Get him immediately when you can. To stack up those hits. Oh shoot, Xbox D-pad. <laughs> Switching sides, are you? Huh? Are you? Are you? Oh no, 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 not down there. Not Oh, going in the back. It's gonna reset the counter. Oh, poopers. Well, hopefully I'll get some luck with the meteors. E. E. Okay, mm that could be two hits. One, two, okay, good, good. Shoot him high. Shoot him high, not low. High, there we go, there we go. That one's too low. Okay, things are going smoothly. I still have to do the button mash segment. I don't really care so much about hits now as I do saving time by knocking him for a loop as fast as I can. Okay, one more hit, one more hit. So I'm glad he didn't come to the foreground, because that could have really burned a lot of time. Oh, 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 oh. Hit him, hit him, hit on him. No! Ah, could have finished it. Hit him up, hit him up. Oh, go, go, no, don't go, don't go low. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Okay, 
We've got this. We've got this. Smash that Y button. Fun fact, I can press uh, a, a single button with my thumb about nine times per second. I've done it! <laughs> yeah, the clock stops as soon as you get to this point because that is when the boss rush ends. I gotta do it all over again with Starly to unlock her secret cutscene. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Super tough! Stage 10 has been unlocked! Okay, now I'm gonna show you something here in the story. This is what I mean about Starly's cutscene here. Go all the way down to the bottom, it's probably faster if I use the stylus, oh, 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 or pressed up. Yeah, you'll see here, yeah, there's these thingamabobs here. Oh, well, there's another thing to unlock uh, further down there, but you'll, you'll see when I get to that a little bit later. But yeah, um, Starly's ending would be number 23, if I'm not mistaken. And that'll remain unlocked until you figure out how to unlock it, and you gotta do it via the big boss down. Um, now I'm going to show you something here. Stage 10 is known as the question mark stage, yes. Um, now that's going to correspond with the toys here, whoops, not that uh, stuff, right? It's in the stuff, no, it's not in the stuff. Uh, wait, wait, no wait, the toys are correct, aren't they? Yeah, toy collection, my mistake. Yeah, if you go over to here, see the question mark here, it actually, uh, stage 10 is actually called three question marks but it's also known as super tough stage 10 or super tough area 10 but uh yeah there's the puff top and then it goes to those that stage right there and then the friends are <clears throat> friends are after that so yeah could the question marks here quite literally are i mean they quite literally told you the name of the stage right here but you would never know that just based off of the uh you know the name of it there i mean it it, it it makes it seem like that they were um, trying to hide the name of the stage so as to not spoil it, but no, that is actually the name of the stage. Anyway, I've got to go through Big Boss Town again, but this time with Starly. Um, I wonder if I should cut ahead or if I should, I don't know, because it's not. I'm not going to lose to this, and I'm most certainly not... I mean, I don't have to speedrun this now, so I can take my time, because all I need to do is get Starly's ending, the uh, cutscene here. And I never showed myself beat the bosses with Starly, because I couldn't, you know, connect the, um, the DSs together and team up with someone to do that, because I'm on an emulator. So yeah, maybe I'll do um, these stages with Starly. Remember, she doesn't have the same speed and powers as uh, Starfy has, so you're gonna have to... Ah, shoot. Knocked him out of the sky, though. Mm, I forgot I could do that, actually. Ah, I'm forgetting so much about the Hot Spring Snapper, and that's what kind of what caused me great ire versus him when I was playing as Starfy. Oh, good position, good position. And I flubbed it. Ah, mm. Yeah, as you can tell, I'm not really caring about taking hits so much as I am about, uh, yeah, um, hitting him like so. Mm. Ah, poopers. Is, it, is there any way to skip the second phase of this? I don't think there is. I mean, it, it, it looks like you could possibly stun him inf infinitely. Like, knock him on the ground and immediately stun him again so he can't, um, uh, can't get up and go into stage, or phase two. But it's not like phase two is any um, slower. In fact, it could be faster because you knock off two hit, uh, health per hit. So maybe you don't want to do that, even if it is possible. I'm just, but I'm just curious if that sort of thing is possible. Anyway, King Ping, my nemesis, the first thing that killed me in the walkthrough. Why are you such an annoyance, King Ping? Why? And you, of course, had to stall for time even more. <laughs> Now I know this is impossible to avoid because you immediately stop before you can do any more after a certain point. You're gonna be in bad position, aren't you? Um, 
maybe. Maybe. Well, let's see if I can do that insta-kill thing. Yes! Okay, why didn't that work for me before? Because I'm sure I've tried that before in other playthroughs. I don't know. <laughs> it could have been a glitch when I tried it before, but uh, it works now! <laughs> Alright, all oh, papes. You're gonna be a tough one to speedrun with Starly because she doesn't have the faster star spin. Mm. 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 Okay, stay on the edge, stay on the edge. Oh, you're not going towards me, are you? Mm. Mm. Okay, okay. Go up here, preferably. I don't know what's faster, if, it's, if up or down is faster, in all honesty. Oh, no, 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 I screwed it up. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Over here, please. Thank you. Oh, shoot, got him too far away from the edge. Mm, mm. Gotta optimize my peep strategy. <laughs> I don't know how fast it's possible to beat all the bosses in the game. In the big boss down here. E. Probably, eh, probably half the time that I'm taking here. <laughs> yeah, but I'm fast enough to get under nine minutes, and that's good enough to 100% the game. <laughs> All right, Ronk, you're up next. And, oh, that's right, she doesn't have the double jump. That could be a problem. E. E. Oh, I don't care about the hits. Just as long as I optimize my strikes. Yeah. There we go, okay. Oh, shoot, I didn't pay much attention. There we go. <laughs> Gotta look at the boss gauge more. And yeah, uh, I probably should recover for snips a little bit. I guess she can cause ire at times. There we go, 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 go. <laughs> snips, you're going down again for the fourth time. <laughs> Yeah, quite literally the fourth time. This is the fourth time I've uh, encountered her. Um, first time was as Starfy. Second time was as Starly. Third time was Starfy again in the boss rush. And now, Starly boss rush. Well, a uh, big boss stone. <clears throat> but, you know, it's it's a boss rush. Boss rush is the generic name for um, boss... Chain, I mean, you know, like I'm doing all the game's bosses in a row, or a bunch of bosses in a row like that. Uh, anyway, let's get. Mm, sh mm, mm, mm. It's, ah, she, she doesn't have that faster star spin, and I'm used to doing it with the faster star spin. Ah, mm. Come on, one more, one more, one more. Yeah, no! Mm, why did you guard that? Ah. Probably because you wanted to protect yourself. But still, you're ruining my run. And go, 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 go! Papes first. Come on. Oh, you got in my way, Snips. You got in my way. Oh, no! Oh, didn't mean to do that, but she can sometimes hit herself with bombs. <laughs> I'm not complaining, because that does help. I bet that's one of the factors for the world record speedrun of this, is Snips killing herself. <laughs> And one more for Ronk. There we go. Snips. No, 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 no. Need to speed up the bomb. Going around. Go, 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 go. Mm. Oh, it's not going to hit her, is it? Not before it explodes, at least. Uh, you're up. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, you're up there. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. <laughs> there we go. As I said, I don't have to speed run this, but I would still like to get through this um, ASAP. Because this is basically me repeating myself here. Yeah, shoot. No. No. And she doesn't have... Oh, shoot. She doesn't have the um, ground pound. So I better be more careful here. Yeah. There you go. Sure, jump is just not as high. So, oh, shoot. Yeah. You're going to try and suck me in though, aren't you? Yep. That's what I thought. Whenever your health gets low, you tend to do that. Uh, four health. Versus three. Can I do this? Uh, probably. Oh! Oh, what a shoot! Oh, one day! <sighs> that could have killed me. Yeah, you can shake yourself out of that, but wait, come to think of it, would that have been the faster way to um, make him stop doing that, is to get sucked in and then shake yourself out of it? That might be, that might be another speedrunning tactic you could use. 
Maybe it was good that I didn't cut ahead to when I uh, faced Mega Mash Tooth with, with uh, Starly here. Anyway, Mega Mash Tooth! Go! I think I'm actually making better time than I did with Starfy. Yeah, because I was uh, going in past six minutes when I was with Starfy. Maybe it's because I'm. Shoot. He's got more, because I'm more practiced now, because I did it with Starfy first. And that that's probably why I'm uh, um, saving more time. And I don't I don't know I don't know exactly where I'm saving time, but it's probably because I'm just a little bit more efficient now, as I said, because I've had some practice. Alright, meteor attack! Bring it on! Remember, preferably high, not low. Eat. This uh Meteor attack can make or break a run, just like a lot of the other bosses' attacks, where it's a lot of improvisation and a lot of uh, luck as to where things go. Ah, like, see, I got to get him to shoot these things upward. Shoot, now those are going low. Ah, ah now I'm losing time. Oh, now he's gonna come in the foreground. No, I have to really hustle to get a hit him on him in here. Ah. Wait, 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 I don't thought we will get one, because he's gonna... Yeah, there we go. Here, maybe I'll get a second. I didn't think so. <laughs> I still got two minutes to spare if I am to, quote-unquote, beat this fully as Starly if I want to get under nine minutes. You know, if I wanted to try and unlock Super Tough Stage 10 with Starly, per se. Oh, Come on. No! Missed him! Hit him! Hit him! Yes! Yes! Now come in the foreground, preferably. So I can get quick... Nope, nope, not going to, are you? Well, maybe this will work. Still don't care about hits. As long as I hit him... Yes! Okay, I've got it, I've got it. Button mash! Mash that Y button before the moon is even on you! On, hurry up and shoot it back at me. You can play tennis faster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and there it is, Starly's ending. Secret cutscene! Not really all that special. <laughs> I mean, it just replaces Starfy with uh, Starly in that. And I also got uh, 70. Um, uh, wait, is that? Oh, yeah, Starfy's best time was 737.74. Uh, seven, yeah. Ah, okay, that's fine. Whatever. Oh, wait, or was it? Hold on, oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, yeah, 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 the best was... Wait, I actually wasn't paying attention to what my time was with Star Starly. Well, I'll see in the recording later. <laughs> anyway, now let's go to the story. And sure enough, there it is. Starly's ending is unlocked as number 23. Woo! And with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I start Super Tough Stage 10.